Hi guys, welcome to CA Inter Material Costing MCQs. We are doing this uh, MCQ, so therefore you all can be getting cent percent marks in your exams, at least in MCQs. That goes a long way in clearing your exams. So let's do them. When material prices fluctuate widely, the method of pricing that gives absurd results are absurd means weird results. Okay. So the four options, please bring them. Simple average. Uh, B, weighted average. D is moving average. And lastly, D is inflated price. Now, I hope that you all know how does each and every method work. See, simple average is that, suppose you purchased one unit at the rate of rupees 100. Okay. And then you purchased 500 units at the rate of rupees 200. Okay. Under weighted average, what will you do? Total of the amounts, total of the quantity, and then divide. That will give you weighted average price. But simple average price will be simply the simple average of the prices. One lot was purchased at 100. Other lot was purchased at 200. So therefore, simple average will be 150. Obviously, 150 is not even the price. It is just simple average of the rates without considering the quantity. So if you take 150, absolutely useless results will come out. Now, A, simple average is a worse method that you all can use. Simple average should only be used where the prices do not fluctuate much. Okay. In case prices fluctuate a lot, weighted average is always better. It tallies also. Okay. Under simple average, things will not tally. So therefore, in end, you will have to be taking something as a balancing figure. Okay, so A will give all weird results. B will give you the best results. C, moving average will give you far better results because it will take into account like, you know, the last two or three prices. Inflated price also will not be giving you absolutely uh, worse results because usually prices keep on rising. So inflated price method also will usually give you an okay result, although not very great, but still it will be better as compared to simple average. Okay, so therefore answer out of the four, I guess should be A, simple average. Yeah, that's the correct one.